Crackberry.com. Hey everyone, DJ here for Crackberry.com, and I am looking at Hub to Watch for BlackBerry 10. Now, Hub to Watch is a Pebble smartwatch app, but it works in conjunction with Talk to Watch and is not meant to replace um, Talk to Watch. Talk to Watch still gives you the main notifications where you can read um, the, co you know, the contents of the email, your general kind of Pebble functions, but Hub to Watch brings uh, a little bit more and it actually integrates well it catches all the accounts that you have in um, the the hub um, basically all the accounts you have in the hub um, hub to watch will catch and then you it can notify you um, on your watch it doesn't give you the contents of them but it just alerts you to say that you've got a new black message you've got a new BBM and um, you've got a new uh, you know, LinkedIn message uh, or whatever. You can see that just increased because I got an email through, um, but I don't have email on here. But you can see the ones I've got here. Uh, I've got a black notification. These are your general notifications in the hub. Um, this is the BBM telling me I've got eight unread ones. Um, you don't have to have the app open. Once you've got everything set, you can just close this. It is a headless app, so you don't need to have Hub to Watch running, but you do have to have talk to watch pro installed and running in order to get all the functionality out of hub to watch this is just you know something for show um, when you open the app this is the first thing you see if it hasn't caught any since you've opened hub to watch it will just say no um, unread activity and these are all the things it catches um, after you've opened it uh, I'm just gonna jump in the settings right here I'm um, just show you these are the different hub accounts you can tick the ones you want to come through and be alerted for um, and the ones you don't. I don't need email or calls to come through because Talk to Watch gives me that functionality but it's there if you want to know how many unread, um, the unread count. Uh, you can see LinkedIn because that is hub integrated. Third party apps that do integrate into the hub you can see here um, WhatsApp, iGran, um, Instant, Black was on my list. Seem to dis black is on here. Yeah, black's up there. Um, and so you can, you know, anything that comes into the hub, really, including third-party apps, Hub to Watch can catch and alert you of it. Um, other settings here as you, the weather. You can have the weather um, be shown, and you can have your weather options. Uh, these are for your settings. Whenever, um, how many it will show you. Uh, I mean, if it will still show you if it's an unread account. If it's an unread account, it won't show you at all, which is, you know, better. You don't want to know when there's a zero um, inbox in the account. And then you can tell it how it's going to act, when it's going to vibrate, just on first unread activity for each account or all activity that happens. Um, and you can also customize the number of vibrations right here. Uh, I did say... I don't know if I said, but this is a custom watch face, hub to watch watch face. This is hub face, hub to watch watch face 4, hub to watch 4. Um, and these um, watch faces you can install via the app, but you will be able to also find them in the Pebble store via the talk to watch app. You can do a search in the watch faces, go ahead and like them as well, show that there are BlackBerry users using Pebble, uh, the Pebble smartwatch, but you can see you can install them right here. So this one gives you six, I've got the four, and this is just one notification at a time. Um, I will say you can't have more than one running um, of these in one go, and if the watch face does look familiar, it is the Futura Weather watch face. If that is a watch face you use, I do suggest uninstalling that as well. They all, because they're kind of based upon the same watch face, they don't work together if they're all in, in installed on the Pebble Watch. So I will say to install um, if you're going, if you're going to try out another, uninstall it, and then install the watch face you want to try out. Um, so you can see, just go back to the watch face here. Now I've got the four watch faces. Um, if a new message comes through. Uh, an asterisk will appear next to it saying that's the newest message that's come through on that account um, so an asterisk will will appear on there just as it does here oops just as it does on this screen but like I said you won't have this screen because 
hub to watch is headless um, but just as an example there will be an asterisk next to the number on your watch this is a really quick look at hub to watch talk to watch plus hub to watch is a great combination if you want to be able to get all the notifications and catch all the ones in the hub and it's great that you can customize it one other thing I didn't show this one here show battery on wrist shake um, let me focus in again when you are on the hub to watch watch face shake your wrist and you can get notification for the pebble and your watch and you can turn this off like I said it only works if you're on this watch face if you are in another watch face that isn't anything to do with hub to watch it won't work um, but it is an option it's there if you want it so um, it's just a quick look um, I also forgot to add when you first run the app there's a tutorial that will run because you have to authorize and connect it to talk to watch um, I've already done it so it doesn't appear but when you first open the app, the app first use the app you'll go through this authorization just to make it connect with talk to watch um, if anything happens and the connection is broken because it um, or anything you might need to rerun the tutorial but it all seems smooth I haven't had to rerun it um, in the time I've used it at all um, so yeah that is a look at hub to watch for BlackBerry 10 it is a dollar 99 in BlackBerry world uh, and it's available for all BlackBerry 10 smartphones again you need talk to watch pro which is the paid version of talk to watch in order to get all um, use of hub to watch and of course you do need the pebble watch too um, so hub to watch for BlackBerry 10 go get it now from BlackBerry world bye Thanks for watching.